that range landing kicks, he's just constantly putting damage on you. Top, bottom, up, low, it does not matter. This guy is a dominant striker, one of the best kickboxers the UFC has ever seen. And in terms of the punching technique and the jab, as good as anyone in this division. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a set. One more Ladies time for the official introduction. This is Here's Bruce the Bruce main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the O2 Arena in London, England. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA, Assassin. And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. it is and it's going to be interesting and it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand here. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Big punch lands through the middle. Punch is blocked. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Looking to set up that head kick again. This one does not find the hole. Oh, tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike that he is landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. Real sneaky body hit. Big powerful punch land. Now he gets back to range. Nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. Big leg kick land. Start to see some of the damage cut underneath that right eye. Slips. Oh, huge block! Under three minutes to go in round one. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? He 
loaded up on that right hand, too. Good defense to block the strike coming back. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, nice right hand. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Nice straight punch. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. There's no give on that leg And kick. both guys really throwing with authority. Just unable to quite find that range. You gotta check these low leg kicks. He is all about that left kick to the body. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Nice head kick. Big kick lands. Lee gets caught by that straight punch there. So we cross the 37. Oh, a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot, that will finish the fight. 15 seconds. Oh, big punch lands. Oh, nice hook. That was a crippling shot right there. Threw it real tight. Elbow tight. Big check in it. Landed it right on the chin. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round. And he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there and he's not on his toes and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. Get back All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Lee's kick to the body is blocked. Oh, big head kick. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. Nice head kick. Nice. Trying to establish that jab once again. Able to check that kick as well. Nice kick. Lands to the body there. Right punches there. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Caught that kick there. 
Oh, just misses with the kick. Caught that. Now, there's danger in that, too, because when you start reaching out to catch that kick, here comes the high kick, and then you're in a lot of trouble. Well, a really good second round for him thus far. After a somewhat lackluster first round, he has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Just out of range with that right hand. He just keeps on coming with these shots to the liver, looking to buckle him once again. Buckled him earlier in the fight, and the fighter is still open to damage there as he continues to target that sensitive area. Leg kick checked effectively there by Lee. Pretty significant well to the left side. separate. Look at the turtle in that kick. Try to establish that jab. Press forward, get that takedown. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. That was snuck in. Nice strike. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Big body kick lands. Thirty seconds to go now. Oh, the fight thus far. How's his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over, and it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Lee gets hit with a kick. Nice counter left hook to the head. Oh, huge spinning kick. Ten minutes in the books. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the making. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Shot is blocked there by Lee. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Big punch land. Ooh. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. It's okay, keep going. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Yeah. 
So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Beautiful body kicks. Beautiful punch. Well, one got through, that kick was blocked. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Right hand upstairs. There, huge block. Hey, it's off balance. Take the shot. Take the shot. Take the shot. He can't defend you. Straight right hand now just misses. Caught the kick. And able to land a nice shot there on the inside. Big left hook coming. It's blocked. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Relax, relax. Nice strike. Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one-two punch there by Lee. Now connects with a right. Back and forth we go here. I need you to get that takedown now. Hold you. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Bust it out. Keep flicking your jab. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Oh, nice slip there. Great head movement overall by this guy defensively tonight. He does a great job of moving his head side to side really mixing up the motion at which he moves. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Slips the shot. He blocks the punch. 20 seconds to go. Lee gets caught with that punch. Final seconds of round three. Superman punch. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are gonna be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're gonna see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, DC, here we go with our next round, and we'll see if he can pick up where he left off. High volume of strikes landed in the previous round. High volume of strikes landed. He was able to be accurate, but also very, very active in his approach to the start of this fight. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Big kick. Big kick. This fight's going to be over this year. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. 
and now he's got him hurt very badly. Looks as though he's dealing with a cut above the eye here. You wonder if the offensive fighter is going to start to get frustrated here. Most stiffed on all these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Lee gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Clipped him with the right hand there. Punch coming, it's blocked. Oh, and he caught the kick. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Big leg kick land. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Body kick is blocked. with the kick there. No pat on that foot. No shit guard. He's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. Well, some fighters, when they get cracked in the mouth, they respond well. He got stunned earlier in the round and hasn't really recovered or gotten back into things. People react differently, right? Some people just get back going. He's having a hard time building his way back into this fight. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Just misses with the jab there. Big kick lands. They continue to exchange. Tie. Nice leg kick there by Lee. Oh man, that couldn't have felt good. Flush knee lands to the body by the taller fighter. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Right hook to the head block. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Nice body kick. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Just missed with the left there. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Ten seconds remaining here in round four. Twenty minutes down, potentially five to go. We lost that last round. We're losing the fight. Yeah. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent, and as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets underway. He should stay the course.
course, he's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Oh, that's a big hook to the chin. Huge block there. Ooh, big shot, man. Looks like that shot was blocked. The left hook lands on the counter. Just misses there with the left. He just hurt him with a left hook. Yep. Good punch, Lance. Kick lands. Nice head kick. Lands the right punch and follows it up with a nice left hand. Nice sequence there by Lee. Oh, that's a nice strike. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. All right, well, time is the enemy now, DC, and he's really running out of it if he's going to get his hand raised tonight. He's got to go forward. He's got to go forward every added opponent to try and find that punch or that kick that's going to end the fight. There is no time for strategy anymore. What a punch. My goodness! Two minutes now to go in the fight. Throwing that jab, no good. Ooh, what a punch. Sneaky head kick. Liver kick. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh, huge Superman punch. Hook attempt now blocked, though, by Lee. Can't take many of those. You better check. One minute to go in the fight. Don't wait, don't wait. I need you to be first now. Good punch. Leg kick. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Visibly limping here. Seconds left. Oh, tags him with the jab on the counter. Final seconds of this fight. He missed with that jab attempt there. And they separate. What else can you say but what a fight?
All right, so the fight goes the distance as we await the judges' scorecards, but certainly a dominant striking effort out of that fighter tonight. John, he used his best weapons in order to carry him to a decision, a very clear decision, in my opinion. A great performance tonight by this young fighter. See how the judges saw it. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 50 45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon!